I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty, and I'm excited that you're here with me today to see Emily Noel's new palettes. Yes, that's right. I am so excited about this. Emily Noel finally got her own set of makeup, and it couldn't happen to a more deserving person. You'd have to be under a rock to not know Emily Noel. She is one of the first YouTubers that I ever saw on YouTube when I discovered YouTube only about three years ago. Emily is the sweetest, most kind, most loving person. She's unbelievable. She's from the Midwest, so she has all those wonderful Midwestern values. But more than that, she just emphasizes the positive. Watching her is a wonderful, wonderful experience, and she is like a savant of makeup. She knows everything about makeup. She can actually remember back to the first makeup she ever wore, the brands and the whole bit. She was meant to do makeup videos. There is just something about Emily that's just very, very special, and I tend to think that the reason we're attracted to people is the amount of love that radiates from their heart. I think all of us in our hearts have the same amount of love in our hearts, but some of us are able to let that out into the world more. And Emily just does that. In fact, when I first came to YouTube, maybe three years ago, you know, I'm a little older than most people here. I'm 50 plus, we shall say. And when I came to YouTube, I was just amazed by the whole thing to begin with because I'm not that much into social media. And one of the first YouTubers I discovered was Emily. And she is so warm and kind and comforting. There's just something so comforting about watching her videos that many, many, many nights, still to this day, I fall asleep with Emily Noel videos on my chest, just watching Emily and being comforted by her. So if you haven't been to her channel, you need to go check her out for sure. And you really need to check out her palettes. She has two of them that she's released. And the people at Revolution Makeup joined with Emily to create these palettes. The first is the Emily Edit Needs Palettes, and this is a full face makeup in terms of everything but the wet ingredients. doesn't have mascara or foundation, something like that. But it has contour and highlighter and a wonderful blush shade. In fact, I'm wearing all of it here. And then a wonderful under brow shade, and then she's got some eyeshadows here, and a wonderful black called Passion. Everyone needs a black. And this palette is only $15. And then she has the Wants Palette, and Emily is fabulous with a lot of color in terms of eyeshadow. Look at this palette. Absolutely beautiful. And they call it the Edit Palettes because Emily worked with Revolution Makeup to determine the absolute best shades of their full line, and they have tons of shades of makeup. And so she's got pretty much everything you would ever want. That's why it's called the Wants Palette. And today I'm going to be showing you a makeup mostly from Emily's Needs Palette. And so I'll be taking off everything but foundation, and we'll get started. Okay, now we're up close and personal, and I'm going to start dipping into this wonderful palette. We're going to start with a little bit of kindness on the brow. We can all use a little more kindness. You know, it's so funny. That's one of the main things I love about this palette, is the fact that whenever you're using it, it's really making you think about the things this world needs more of, and actually about the things we each need more of because you can't really control the world. All you can control is yourself and your attitude. So we're going to put a little kindness in our lives right now on the brow bone. A little kindness on the brow bone. Then I'm going to go in with a little bit of love on the lid. Just going to brighten up that lid with a little bit of love. A little sprinkling of love. There we go. Now we're going to use a little bit of peace as a transition shade. Just going to dip into that right there. Just going to do the outer V and a little bit right there on the, on the crease. Love that warm peachy tone. Do the other side. It's the perfect transition color, peace. And actually it's the perfect transition to life. We can all use a little more peace. Now to complete that transition, I'm going into Hobby, which is so funny because I'm sure Emily started her YouTube channel as a hobby years ago, but look what it's become. And the cream always rises to the top, and she has a color called the cream, because her mother always told her that the cream rises to the top and not to worry unless your detractors hurt your feelings, which when you're rising, there always are detractors. I have noticed that in my own life. And one thing I don't like is women not supporting women. I just think that's not, that's not productive of any of us. We need to support each other and be loving towards each other. Okay, now let's go into that little color, Hope. It's a beautiful brown shade. We're just going to darken up that outer V with some Hope. 
and also go into the transition a little bit. Whoa, that is a pigmented color. Oh my, we're going to have to blend that, ladies. Then we're going to go into the other side, do a little hope over there. Everybody needs hope. And that is our job in this world, is to give others hope. To lighten up a little bit of the darkness out there. That's an important thing. Now I'm going to blend that out. There we go. Then I'm actually going to take a little bit of this contour shade called Courage. I'm going to go in underneath the eye to do a little lower liner. Go into the outer V a little bit with that. There we go, a little more Courage. Yeah, that's okay. Sorry. There's coffee in there. Oh, good. Wait, I think I'll come get some. Well, I guess I won't. Okay, that's the eyeshadow. Now off camera, I'm going to go ahead and put on some liner and mascara. And there are the eyes, and I'm going to finish it off by adding yet another little Emily trick. And this is the Wet n Wild Ultimate Highlighter. Absolutely love this. And I'll show you what it does. We're just going to put the little white down in the underline. And it's kind of a tan color, not really a white and see how it just brightens that eye. Do the other one. I should have done this before my mascara, but I forgot. And that is something I do pretty much every day and it really just opens up your eyes. Okay, for blush, let's go in with a little bit of this Joy. I love this color. It's a color that I've really learned to use. I really like the fuchsia and the pinks when I started out on YouTube. But now I really like these more natural peachy tones, and I think it's a tone that anyone can pretty much wear. And that's probably why she used it in this palette, since it's supposed to work for everyone. It is the needs. Okay, there's that blush. Now let's go in and sculpt the cheekbones a little further. We're going to use a little bit of this contour called Courage. Everyone can always use a little bit of Courage, and I'm very light with that. Whoa, that's an intense contour. Other side. Along the chin. A little bit under there. Now we're going to go into this wonderful little highlighter called Gratitude. Very, very pretty. Right along the upper part of the cheekbones. A little bit on the apples of the cheeks little bit down the nose. Very nice. Now carrying on Emily's tradition of reasonably priced makeup, I'm going to be going in with this Essence Lipstick in 03 Wow Effect. Now I haven't worn it in a while and I've forgotten how much I liked it. Very pretty lipstick. Well, that was a look at a nearly full face makeup with Emily Noel's new palettes. And Emily, congratulations. It couldn't happen to a more deserving person. Well, if you're not a subscriber and you're interested in making your second half your best half, I hope you'll subscribe and click that little bell. That will just send you notification of my weekly videos. And I always like to leave you with a little thought for the day. And I'll be drawing a card from the Power Thoughts cards from Louise Hay. Let's see what Power Thoughts we can think about for today. Here we go. Ooh, I am at peace. I am at peace. And that was one of Emily's eyeshadows. Divine peace and harmony surround and dwell in me. I feel tolerance, compassion, and love for all people, myself included. Oh, friends, I absolutely love this card. I am at peace. And it just reminds me so much of Emily's palette. Compassion, peace, tolerance, all those wonderful things in that palette are things that we need to have more of in our life. And really, it all starts with us. There's a huge lesson in all of this. Just like with that eyeshadow palette, we each work on our own makeup every day. We each need to work on our own makeup every day. The wonderful things that make up each of us. And you know, we all have lightness and dark within us. And Emily is a wonderful example of that because her light essence in her just shines so bright. But she's a human just like we all are. She has the light and the dark and she chooses every day to get up and put on her light face, put on her shiny face. And friends, that's what we need to do. We need to be at peace. 
We need to let harmony, compassion, tolerance, and peace surround us because when we do that, not only do we have a wonderful second half, but we make the world a better place to live in. Take care. See you next time.